Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to buy the Project Quantum token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. I'm going to be showing you step by step everything that you need to do in order to purchase this token. But before we get started, I just want to remind everyone that I do have daily cryptocurrency tutorials coming on this channel. So if you guys are interested in crypto and you want to learn how to buy, how to sell, and more, I'd really recommend subscribing to this channel as I'll have lots of content coming out now and into the future. Anyhow, just to get started with this tutorial, you just have to head into Trust Wallet. And just to let everyone know, I'm not going to show you guys how to create your trust wallet in this video or how show you guys how to purchase or transfer BNB into your trust wallets. If you guys need to learn how to do that, I will have the tutorials linked for those two things in the description as well as in the comment section down below if they are needed. So if they are needed, just be sure to go check those out there and then you'll be able to catch up to where I'm at now. Uh, but all you guys have to do is basically have BNB inside of your smart chain wallet. And if you guys have purchased from PancakeSwap before, you already know how to do that. Uh, so once you guys have BNB in your smart chain wallets on here, you can go ahead and we have to add the contract address for the token that we're looking to purchase. So if you go with the link I have in the description, it'll be over to CoinMarketCap, and then it will show us the Project Quantum token right here. And what we want to do is copy this contract address that we see right here beside contracts. I'll put a red circle around this little copy button that you have to click. But if you just click on the copy button there, we can head back over to Trust Wallet. And once we're back in Trust Wallet here, we can navigate to the top right of the screen where we see the two lines and two circles. So if you just go there, click on that, and then go to the top search bar, you'll be able to paste the contract address in. Then we'll see the Project Quantum token right here. So we just click on Enable to enable the token, and then click on Done. And once you guys have the Project Quantum token in your trust wallets here, all we have to do now is go over to PancakeSwap, and I'll have a link over to PancakeSwap in the description, as well as in the comment section down below. So if you just head over to PancakeSwap, all we have to do here is just go to the top left corner where we see the three lines. Just go ahead and click on that. Then we just want to click on Trade to drop down this menu, and then we can go ahead and click on Exchange. Once we're in the exchange here, we're going to have to connect our wallet. And to do that, if we just go to the top right corner of the screen where we see the connect button, you can go ahead and click on connect. And then instead of clicking on trust wallet here, we're actually going to click on wallet connect. And then here we have to choose a preferred wallet. In this video, I'm going to be showing you with trust wallet, but you can use any of these other wallets if you guys want to. Uh, so for this video, I'll just be showing you with trust wallet. So let's go ahead and click on trust wallet. Once you click on trust wallet here, you're going to have this confirmation pop up asking you to connect your pancake swap to your trust wallet. So you just want to go ahead and click on confirm or connect, sorry. Then we can just go back to our browser. Once we're back to our browser here, we'll know our wallets are connected when we see our contract address up in the top right corner, as well as our balance of BNB right above where it says BNB and our balance is shown right there. Uh, now, if you guys don't see your balance of BNB here, it's just because you don't have your BNB in your smart chain wallet. So make sure you have your BNB in your smart chain wallet and then reconnect your wallet and everything should be working perfectly. Anyhow, once you guys have everything ready to go here, we just have to click select a currency. Then we can paste that same contract address up in this top search. Once we do that here, we'll see the Project Quantum token. So we just click on Import, I understand, and Import. Once this is done here, we have to decide how much BNB that we want to transfer into the Qubit or Project Quantum token. So we just decide here to say, for example, I'm going to transfer 1 BNB. I can go ahead and type 1 BNB. And once you type that in here, you will see the estimated amount that you'll get in exchange. Now, the last thing that we have to do is we have to go up to our three lines right beside exchange and switch our slippage tolerance to 12%. You guys can try 10% if you would like to. Uh, but I usually use 12% as my tra transaction will go through the first time I attempt it. Uh, but like I said, you could try 10 if you would like to. But once you guys are done here, we just have to click on where it says unlock wallet for me. It'll just tell you here to swap. And then it'll show you a broken version of your transaction, basically showing you your fees and your withdrawal rates and things like that. Now, if you're happy with what you see there, you can go ahead and click on swap one more time. And then you can exit back into your trust wallet. And your project quantum token will arrive in your trust wallet, it's usually within a couple minutes. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to buy the Project Quantum token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. If this video did help you out, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching.